This video is sponsored by SellCashier.com. SellCashier pays top dollar for your used iPhone. Get a quote, ship your phone, and get paid. It's that simple. Check out more details at the end of this video. What's up, Geeksters? It's me, Omar, from GeeksterLabs.com. How's it going today, guys? Well, today I have a photography slash video accessory that I want to show you. And this is a product that was sent to me free for review from Vanguard. And today we have the Vanguard Tripod Ulta Pro 263AP, which is like a kit tripod that I have so it's basically the tripod and the head together and so I'll go into details about that stuff specifically but this basically retails for 250 on the website but you can easily find it for way under $200 on Amazon and I have the link to that down below in the description so basically this is an aluminum tripod with a, a photo pan head on it is what basically is how it's titled on their website you can definitely use it for video as well and I'll show you how that works in just a second so, but I've been using it in a lot of my videos uh, recently for all of my videos actually for about a month an hour or so and I've really enjoyed this tripod but before we get into all the features and the specs let's talk about what's included with this product so first off we have the instructions next we have an included tool with an allen wrench and a bayonet wrench on it as well and the best thing that's included with this product is a carrying case and this is a very nice heavy duty real durable uh, carrying case with a shoulder strap if you do want to uh, put the whole tripod in here you will have to take off the handles off of the tripod to tighten it up if you can leave it with the handle sticking out if you want to but you know you have the likelihood of maybe losing that or, or damaging them so if you completely remove the handles throw them in the bag you can zip it up nice and tight and they fit in there real well so before we talk about any features let's get into the specs so this is a very solid good sturdy tripod it actually weighs in at 5.73 pounds so it has some good heft to it and the max load on this tripod is 11 pounds okay so the legs they're all aluminum leg tubing they have a diameter of 26 millimeters and it comes in three sections and uh, so when it's closed and folded it's only about 20 and a half inches off the ground but uh, the legs fully extended go to 57 inches and then if you extend the neck out, it goes to an even further 69 inches. So the head that we have on this tripod is a PH32 is what they call it. And it has a lateral tilt of negative 60 degrees to 90 degrees. And it has a frontal tilt of negative 30 degrees to 90 degrees. And it also has a 360 degree pan, which is very smooth and very nice for getting some of those, those uh, panning shots. So now let's get into some of the features. So let's start at the very top here. So first off, like I said, we have a three-way fluid pan head, okay, with two handles. So one controls the panning and the tilting forward and back and then the other handle controls the lateral tilt but it's super smooth you have to tighten and loosen the handles to control some of the smoothness and when you're moving them back and forth it also features this rapid action knob on the side to lock the pan and tilt it's really easy to go from shooting photos to shooting video when you need to just pan and in photos you need to pan and tilt at the same time at times so by just by turning that knob it'll lock in that place and you can just pan with it also on the head we have a three bubble levels which is pretty convenient and nice to use on the top we have a nice rubber slip resistant quick shoe with a real nice spring loaded double locking system so you can't accidentally unclip it and have it drop your camera and the best part about the head is that it's removable so you can swap out heads or if you upgrade to a different brand of head that you want to do you want to use on here and so whenever you remove it you can use the tool and it features a one fourth and three eighth screw adapter so it also makes it real handy for using sliders and other accessories and you can use the include tool like i said to remove that screw adapter also and you can store it in the neck right there and so the neck itself actually features a bubble level. So moving further down, the next thing we have here is an anti-shock rubber ring. Um, it's nothing too fancy, but it's just like a ring that goes around the neck here. So if you do have your camera and you just by accidentally maybe loosen up the, the neck, the travel on the neck to lower it up and down, and if you drop it, it's not going to just slam your camera straight down. It actually has a little bit of absorption. We have some foam grip pads here on the legs as well, which is kind of nice. And so the tubing for the neck is like hexagonal shape. And the really cool feature is the accessory hook. So it does have an accessory hook on the bottom there. If you pull it down below, you can and add more weight bags to it to make it even heavier in case you're you're uh, it's a windy area or you're shooting in a place where you need to make sure that this thing is going to be moving or bumped into so you can add additional weight bags on that accessory hook as far as the legs go we have three different uh, leg angles that you can go into so the first initial angle is 25 degrees you can pop it out to 50 degrees and then you can pop it out even more to 80 degrees which is kind of crazy how you're able to do that but I'm gonna show you in a second why that is so awesome so let's get into the some of the other features here as well we like I mentioned we do have the quick flip leg, leg locks which do a really good job of uh, making sure they don't slide out by accident on the bottom of the feet we have rubber feet and of course we have the spikes so if you retract them or or push them in you have the spikes if you're gonna be outside on a you know grass or something like that make sure that the tripod doesn't move 
So now let's get into the killer feature of the Alta Pro 263AP, which is the removable neck. So if you guys see here, on the bottom we have a little push button here. If you push that in, loosen all the levers, you can slide it completely out of the neck right here. And after you do that, you can easily tilt an, an angle with the Mac system. So they have a, it's called a multi-angle central column, and that basically supports any direction of moving exclusively uh, like low profile or photography, then kind of macro photography, things like that. If you want to film something overhead, you can usually pull it out there. And so it has this thing called the instant swivel stop and lock system. And that's how little, that little lever that you see on the side there. So when you pull it open, it loosens it up and you can angle it up. You can slide the neck into there. And when you tighten and, and tighten that lock up right there, it doesn't move at all. And it's going to hold the weight of that camera pretty well. Now, keep in mind when you are angling and using this, you have to, you have to be mindful of the weight of the camera because it, it will tip over really easily. So if you have it in a certain positions, you can find the right sweet spot to where it won't just tip over accidentally. But it does have that hook on the bottom to where you can add a, a weight bag to it if you want to make sure it stays in place and doesn't tip over. But I think that's one of the coolest things about this tripod. So you can get some really interesting angles, whether you want to shoot over a desk, shooting straight down, things that you wouldn't normally be able to do with a tripod. And the really cool thing is normally if you want to shoot really low to the ground, I mean, there's not that many options as far as tripods go. But what you can do with this is you can pull out the legs 80 degrees, keep it flat, to put the the neck at an angle, and then you can get super low to the ground even shooting up and really cool, interesting up, up shots and things like that that you could do with this tripod. It, overall, it's a very cool, flexible tripod, and I've enjoyed using this very much so. I know a lot of people are really big on brand names like Manfrotto and things like that, but of course those, those brands are going to cost you quite a, a bit of money. But um, I have been pleasantly surprised by the amount of quality uh, at the price point that you're able to get with this tripod. It's very flexible. Like I said, you can do many things with it. And my overall experience with it has been very, very nice. So I would definitely recommend you guys checking it out. If you're looking for a tripod, you don't have 200, over $200 to spend on a tripod, but you want something that can give you a lot of variables and things you can change up to, for filming and for doing your videos, um, I would recommend you go checking this out. Like I said, I'll put a link in the description for Amazon. I believe they may even have this for like 160 170 on Amazon, depending, on, of course, on the price that they're, they're listing on there. But just a really great product. It's very well made. It feels very sturdy, very heavy duty. It's going to do a good job of traveling with you, going with you wherever you need it to go. And uh, I just think it's, it's just a really, really nice product. So if you have any questions about anything you've seen so far, post those down below. I read each and every comment on all of my videos, and I will always do my best to get back to every all of the questions you guys post down there. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you want to stay up to date with all of my content on YouTube, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel as well. And as always, guys, make sure you stop by GeeksterLabs.com for the latest in tech news and video reviews. And I will see you in the next video review. SellCashier.com offers you good money for your used iPhone, and it's very easy. Here's how it works. Visit SellCashier.com, select your phone's model, carrier, storage size, and condition, and instantly receive a quote for your phone. After that, choose your shipping option, which includes having a prepaid label and box sent to you. Once Cell Cashier receives your package and examines your phone to assess its condition, you will receive payment via PayPal or check. And that's it. Super simple and much safer than dealing with those weirdos on Craigslist. SellCashier.com. Simple, fast, secure.